Well, uh, recently, the family of Terry Carter actually filed an $81 million civil suit against Suge. You ain't gonna get it. Well, it went to trial and ended up being a mistrial. Mm. It was like, I think seven people found Suge guilty, but five did not. And they just could not, you know, no matter how many times the judge told them to go back and right. they just, five people just said, no, we, we don't see it. Right. Well, uh, you know, gonna... and, you know, I mean, number one, I don't think Suge has $81 million. No. I mean, not, not anywhere near that. I heard he's okay, though. I heard he's buying people, you know, girls' cars and stuff like that. That's what I heard from someone. Uh, but, you know, now if the family, the family, since it's a mistrial, they could go and start all over again and right. start a whole new trial. But in, in these types of cases, usually a lawyer takes that on contingency. You know, usually the family doesn't have half a million dollars to spend on a trial right, right. that they might not win, which in this case they, they didn't win. Nobody won. Right. So to find to have a lawyer go through the whole process again, it doesn't seem like it's gonna happen. And at the end of the day, look, I mean, the guy got 28 years. He's lost the company. Whatever money he has is not what it used to be. Uh so, so really, it's almost like a symbolic thing trying to sue him and win. But he's been convicted criminally for it. Right. And, I mean, you know, 28 years is a long motherfucking time. Yeah. To sit behind bars. I know they'll never get Terry back. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, I think sometimes we need to, and I'm only saying this because I had to get over the fact that my brother's gone. Yeah. I ain't got no, I didn't, I'm not mad at nobody. I don't seek vengeance for nobody. I, I gave up. It's a motherfucker to be feeling the way I felt every day, waking up every day, hating people. You know, so this little cat out here made me see that I don't need to be waking up with headaches and Pissed off at the world. You're talking about your grandson. My grandson. Yeah. I don't. I don't have to be like that. Right. So, you know, I I just say it's crazy because I learned a lot of shit since I've had him. Yeah. You know what I'm saying. So maybe I had the time to sit back and reflect on a lot of shit that I've done and that's happening today. I ain't mad at nothing because. Half of the shit I've done, I should be in prison for the rest of my life, mm. and I am. I'm, I'm, I really realize I'm. I'm blessed. 